Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be reacting to Juancito and Gabito Ballesteros music video for Superstar Golden Ink Entertainment Look at Lamborghini So, funnily enough, we just reacted to Peso Pluma VBS and now Gabito This is way more Peso Pluma's beat than VBS was to me you think so? Yeah, this is like, oh. this come on, this I, I'm thinking typical Peso Pluma. I think he did good on the VVS. Oh no, VVS like he sounded saying. good. No, yeah. no, but I'm saying that that wasn't like so much, to me that was more traditional Mexican beat, uh. whereas this one is like that trap. In know. 10 seconds, you know yeah. It has that Lady Gaga beat. Uh. Tell me it doesn't sound like classic Peso Pluma beat. I guess this. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. yep, that trumpet comes mm -hmm. on and everything. It's but they said it wasn't pesos actually who initially started it, so I think mm -hmm. it was Gabito. Mm -hmm. Was it? I remember they were saying Gabito. Yeah, yeah that was Gabito, yeah. <laughs> I gotta say though, that's a long intro. 40 seconds in of a 248 song, we haven't even heard nothing yeah. being said. That's a long intro. It seems like he put a filter over it too. It's like a almost like a throwback blurry filter. It does, yeah, it does have that filter. I see it too. It's always, you know, the classic sound. This is how I, I recognize him. He has a distinct voice, different from Pesa Puma, so I could distinguish between mm -hmm. the two. Because even though they're covering like the similar sound, there there are differences between how they sing this sound. <laughs> Sort of graffiti. Uh, looks mm. like you know what it looks like, like uh, what you call it, uh, ang not anger room. Oh, rage that room. Rage room. Yeah, that's what kind of looks like. You just paint on the wall. <laughs> It reminds me like a throwback when we were younger. We were drawing like stars, crowns, dice. Like it, it's very nostalgic, the very 2000s. Like in your, textbooks. Your parents let you paint on your walls? No, not on the walls. But now since he's a superstar, you can put it on the walls. You've seen that before, that when people, when they make it, they put it on the walls. But back then, like you would put it mm -hmm. like in textbooks. <laughs> Black song, uh, it's called Superstar, so you yeah, see uh, the graffiti on the walls, the girls, right. the car, well, I don't know which car it was Lambo. in the beginning. Uh, we don't have the caption, so I don't know mm. what he said, but I assume, you know, Superstar is a flex song, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You know, part of the choreography for them too, as well, is to do the pretend I'm playing the guitar, the instrumentals. I like seeing that mm. too, so. But this one, uh, have we heard Wanchito? No. Or Wanchito maybe did the instrumentals or? Uh, Wanchito, is our first, Wanchito is our first time hearing Wanchito. Oh, yeah, I don't know what that is. I think one Cheeto is this guy with the white shades. White shades? Oh. Yeah, that's one Cheeto. That, I think this is Gabito. Mm.
Soy una super estrella. They have pretty similar voices. They have pretty, yeah. yeah this is gonna say. They're pretty. They sound pretty too similar. Close, yeah, yeah. They're, they're very close. Yes. If if the music video wasn't there, I would probably yeah, think it's like one person Yeah. Now we see them together it, doing the back and forth. Honestly, it sound very similar. Honestly, it sounds like. One person just kind of adjusting his voice, voice a little bit, yeah, like changing yeah, his voice yeah. a little bit to sound like either like deeper or lower, oh. you know. But it does sound very similar. <laughs> It's a lazy product they put yeah. out. This song is pretty lazy. They're barely singing. It's mostly instrumentals. The music video also is it's not really just like one mm -hmm. frame with the girls and around the car. Yeah, not much going on. Yeah, I feel like they could have done a better job. <laughs> Because legit, the song is already 240 and mm. I, I feel like half of the song was instrumentals. Like mm. I feel like they barely said anything. And then if they did say anything, we don't really understand. It's, yeah, so right, really, but it, really it's, had... it's not even about whether you understand or not. Uh, I just felt like they weren't saying much. This was mostly instrumental, so uh, I felt like they could have put yeah. a little more effort into it. Guys, of course, let us know your thoughts. So please like, comment, and subscribe. Join the Discord. And as always, as always, share as much kindness as possible.